I think people who start to think more about their own dignity and the dignity of others and look at society and the things that we want to change, the unequalness, the unfairness, the caste systems, the racial injustice that we experience in America and so many other places, that those people find acting with empathy, which is caring about somebody else's issues and relating to them and putting themselves in those shoes and compassion, having compassion for others comes very naturally. And for people that don't think about this and don't practice it and don't focus on it, I think it's so easy to practice in this world through social media, hate and non-acceptance, uh, judgment of others based on the, these things that separate us, your religion or your gender, or it's so easy to type people and say they're different, I don't like them, or they're causing me problems. So I think it's one of the world's biggest challenges is how do we build harmony? How do we build peace? The world is not going to be less diverse. The world is going to become more diverse. And you see how these issues are causing so much instability and so much waste of billions of dollars uh, to fight wars and to promote ethnic violence and intolerance. And for schools, it's a big issue because, you know, when you're 9, 10, 11, 12, that's when you start to differentiate yourself from your family values. Some of them might you accept and some of them you may question, but that's the time in life where in all societies, people start to form their own sense of how to navigate the world. And that's why it's so important beyond the academics that are so important to start to focus on some of these issues because they really matter and they'll trip us up later if we don't deal with them early.